Oh, he just jumped in the window. Dude, this is insane, bro. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This video was recorded on April 29th, 2023 on Galveston Island, Texas. I'm with Good Citizen News and Galveston Island Transparency. This call was a robbery in progress call. We got there just a little bit behind the cops and the cops actually get their man. They went in this house and got him and pulled him out. So this video is definitely going to be different from most videos on my channel because most videos on my channel show cops pulling people over, writing people tickets, stealing their money, harassing people, manufacturing crimes, and arresting people for victimless crimes, which are all things that I dislike. This video, they catch a violent criminal in the act. They go in and get him out of these people's houses. So it's good to see something happen that we approve of for once. Anyways, let's get to the video. I'll see y'all later. Oh man, they're, look at him. They got guns drawn. Where? In this fucking house right here. Look, he's got his gun thrown. No, it's flashlights. They're flashing their lights in that house. Well, this would be a good live stream right here, dude. <clears throat> What's going on? Is this gun? Okay, we can stay back. We'll stay right here. That's what I like about Officer Jones because instead of being disrespectful and being rude and just bossing us around and telling us to move and stay back, he explains to us that there's a dangerous situation going on just to stay over there and us realizing it is a dangerous situation, then we know better than to go over there and put ourselves in danger. I mean, it's just common sense. Someone broke in. Yep. Well, that's what they said about the Tatiana Jefferson, too. Yeah. Don't shoot anybody through the windows like they did in Fort Worth. Yeah, they got guns drawn. Look, they got guns drawn in the windows. I got to zoom in. This reminds me of what happened, like you just said, good citizen, Tatiana Jefferson. Yeah, I want to go look and see what's going on in the back. There they are. So they don't have a warrant, and they're in these people's backyard. I don't know who called them, but they are in these people's backyard, and they are on the curtilage of this house, like civil rights lawyer likes to say they are on the cartilage they're looking in all the windows they're shining lights in the windows they're shining lights in the windows with the guns pointed in the house this is crazy this reminds me of the same thing that happened to a tatiana jefferson in fort worth texas except we're in galveston texas Looks like that window's been breached right there. So they got three about half walked off down here, no lights on nothing. That's Harvey right there, guys. What's up? Three officers back there. So we got three officers in the backyard and three officers right there. <clears throat> uh oh. This is definitely a better vantage point. 
so glad I moved over here. Did he just say wrong house? They're getting the dog? They're getting the dog, Bruce. They're getting the dog. Ooh, look at that. Good boy. Dude, this is insane, bro. Find somebody? They went in? Yeah, they were in Well, because the house was broken into. They saw somebody broken down. How do they know? They don't have a damn fucking warrant to go in this house. No, but if there's probable cause, which hey, the door's been broken. Guy. Oh. Uh, I'm working on. So this is, this is, ex, ex, what's the word, exigent circumstances? Exigent circumstances. circumstances. So for those of you that don't know, the police can only enter your home in three situations. First and most importantly, they have to have a warrant. Or they get consent from the homeowner. Or third, there's exigent circumstances, which in this case, I'm pretty sure they had exigent circumstances. Someone called the law, said somebody broke into the house. They inventoried the house and there was evidence that somebody broke into the house and they possibly saw the suspect inside the house when they were looking through the windows. So that was their exigent circumstance. Oh, they're going in. Oh, he just jumped in the window. Dude, this is insane, bro. Doors open. There's nobody covering the front. Oh, yeah, there is. They got a cop covering the front door. Dude, this is crazy, bro. They got one. They got one in custody. One in custody. Dude, that was insane, man. Yeah, our guy, uh, yeah, 
you can throw me what you want. I won't throw any of it up. I'm just kind of curious and more information. Uh, you can get a hold of me. We can go make some good people. I just, I like the information more. Because he's, he's, he's a super big problem. He comes in crazy hot on everything. He was off duty and he arrested me. So, you know that's going to be a good show. That guy's in deep shit, man. Fucker had to block right in my damn way. His tag lights are out. Hey man, your tag lights are out. <laughs> Got one. Yeah, no worries, dude. Hey, good job, Jones. You know what's going on? We'll, yeah. we'll, we'll stay back, but if it's like you're just blatant, like stay yeah. back because we said so. Yeah, yeah. I appreciate it, bro. Yeah, hey, good job, good. man. Y'all, y'all did a good job, man. On this one. <laughs> Nabbed a criminal. I mean, they caught the guy in the guy's house. Yeah, yeah, no, no, yeah. I mean, it's a good job. Nobody can say anything bad about that. Yeah, nobody can say nothing bad about that. Police did their job on this one. <coughs> I ain't gonna hear me say nothing bad about it. They're questioning the suspect. Probably reading him his rights. Thing. So the oh, here he comes. Is the thing I appreciate you guys not coming up on the scene. Yeah, no worries. You got a case number? Going, uh, a case number? Yeah. yeah. Like incident number? Hey, we know how to keep ourselves safe, man. When, when, hey, when, when, when there when Hold there's on, something dangerous dick. going on, hey, I'm talking, man. Let yeah. me finish talking. Yeah, go ahead. When there's something dangerous going on, man, we know to stay back. Two, one, they write it down. Ah, uh, you can just say it. Two, two zero two three two zero two three. Yeah, we're yeah. Just, yeah, if y'all say, hey, there's a, somebody in the house or something, we will back up. It just, earlier tonight, we had an officer telling us that we couldn't stand where I knew we could stand and he was making asses or something. So that's why I always say, if you're going to put a paper, you know, I'm cool with that. If y'all talk about it, good with you going wherever you legally can, but yeah. if we still have that same control in that house that you're standing on the property and I tell you we're the same, you can just do it. 
I don't care if you go stand on someone else's property, but all that, we were still working through what all needed to be done. That's why I can't have you in a room with the rest of this. That's why we stay where we did. But hey, man, we'll, 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 we'll work through. We'll work through this stuff, and to address you. That that's not how that works. Time. And I'm, I'm not trying to be a jerk. I understand that we're trying to to straighten this all out so that we can all work together. Yeah, you still have my old business card. Uh, do you already? Yeah, you went to that scene, that house party out west. And Oh, out. yeah, 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 okay, you got you. Sorry, I, just, yeah. I didn't recognize you for a minute. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's a good place. No, you're sure. throwing yeah. all this back out quick. Yeah, oh, yeah, so, it, it comes in pretty quick, man. It's hard when you're part yeah. Sasquatch in. Yeah, yeah I, I ain't trying to bust your balls and stuff, but we'll, we'll, as we work through this, let's just come to an accord yeah. on some of these things, and I, I don't necessarily agree with where you're standing on that, but I'm also not trying to... Be yeah. out of bounds. So let's just work our way through it, and we'll as be with respect. As long as you're willing to work with me, that's yeah, we're, the okay. we're willing to work with it. Like we, I just can't we, we just got to fix this stuff. Up, you know, we can't have like people like Caldwell going around abusing people and yeah. doing bad shit. Well, we're not talking about Caldwell. We're talking yeah. about yeah. right it, here. You know, and your so, interactions with me. And, yeah. I, and I recognize that. I'm going to show you the same respect you give me, and if I ask you or tell you. Yeah. Get off the scene, please. Yeah, just, if, just if, as long as you're respectful okay. as us, then we're respectful of you. And, and I think we've shown that. So, all right. I mean, yeah, so, right, yeah. Guys, no, no, no. Let, let's digest everything and work on to the next one, brother. Right, so it's good seeing you again, brother. Yeah, it's like I said, we know when there's danger and when y'all yeah. are just being dicks. We yeah. know the difference. So, but, all right, man. Hey, That's why we stayed back, man. Well, I appreciate that. Hey, let's get those tag lights fixed, though. Tag yeah, yes. you, have no tag, you have no tag lights. Over half of your vehicles don't have any tag lights on them. Your tag lights are out. Yeah, this one. Yeah. One of our new ones. Yeah, it doesn't have tag lights on yeah, right now. No tag lights. I'm gonna give you a warning tonight. Oh, we're gonna give you just a warning and we're yeah. gonna let you go. Okay. I appreciate it. Yeah, we're just, we're just gonna give no, you. Just we're gonna give you a verbal warning on this. <laughs> and, and one of your cruisers. When one of your newer units. Is, <laughs> yeah, and we, we've been telling cops. Well, it about almost this looks for... like malicious. Like somebody's like taking out like half of your tech. Because yeah. it's literally over half of the cruisers. I haven't seen it. On There's any a lot of them. Yet. But over half of the cruisers, and then one of the cruisers you guys have out tonight with numbers in the back, it was like 1915, one of the 19s, so one of the older grades, it dropped a headlight tonight. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll make sure that gets yeah. addressed. We hadn't seen that before. I think he probably dropped it. We'll hook you up with a fix-it ticket. <laughs> right. Y'all have a good night. All right, man. Hey, y'all did a good job on that too, man.